Boys and girls, you see that I have some special bags right here. There are some really fun things in here. Oh, I can't wait for you to see what's inside. But you're actually not gonna see what's inside. You're gonna reach in there and you're gonna feel what is inside. Because today we are gonna talk about a few of our senses. Remember, we talked about our senses. We talked about our sense of seeing. We're gonna see with our what? Eyes. Our eyes. We're gonna see with our eyes. You can see if Mrs. Stewart does this. Can you see me? No, but now you do, right? So do you do, because that's like playing hide and go see. When I hide, when I hid behind here, you couldn't see me, but then you could see me because you can see with your eyes. Now, if you couldn't see with your eyes, you would be what? Blinded. You would be blind, mm-hmm, you would be blind. And if you're blind, that means your eyes what? You, they don't work, they can't see, that's right. But all of your eyes, you can see. So you can see me and you saw that I went down, you couldn't see me anymore, and then I popped back up and you could see. So you were using your sense of seeing. What were you using? Your sense of seeing. of seeing. Yes, you were using your sense of seeing. Now, close your eyes for just a minute. Close all your eyes. Open your eyes. What did I just do? I knocked on the table, but you didn't see me knocked on the table. How do you know it was me? It could have been somebody else. It could have been anybody. But you weren't using your sense of seeing. You were using your sense of what? Blind. Your sense of hearing. Uh-huh. You were using your what? Sense of hearing. You were using your sense of hearing because you didn't see me do it, but you heard it. Just like, what if you were maybe on the playground? or in your car, and all of a sudden you heard, woo, 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 but you looked around and you didn't see a fire truck or an ambulance, but you heard it, you wouldn't be using your sight, you'd be using your ears, you would be using your hearing, your sense of hearing. But then when that fire truck would come by, then you would see those lights and then you would be using your sense of seeing, wouldn't you? Well, today we are gonna talk about our sense of touch show me your fingers our sense of touch right here touch your head your hair feels what soft. it does feel soft now mrs stewart's hair kind of feels scrunchy or crunchy because i have lots of hairspray in it when mommy puts lots of gel in your hair maybe boys when you go to church your mommy will put lots of gel in it and it kind of feels kind of hard and pokey that means that it's kind of hard isn't it because you can feel that because mommy put lots of gel in there that's hard but right now your hair feels really soft girls your hair feels really soft go like this that's soft feel your clothes what is that that's really what Oh, well, maybe your shirt is scratchy. Come here, Angelina. Let's see. Come over here. Now, she's got a soft t-shirt on, but she has some words right here. It says sunshine. And they are kind of scratchy because they're not soft. Is that tickly? Because they're not made out of soft material. They are made out of stuff that was a little bit scratchy. So we can tell if something is soft or something is scratchy or feel the table. Feel the table. It feels smooth, doesn't it? It's smooth. It is very smooth. But hold it like this hold it like this it's hard isn't it knock on it stop thank you for stopping does it feel like a stuffed animal no a stuffed animal would feel what soft. it would it would feel really soft but that doesn't feel soft it feels what hard. it does it feels hard or rough good job so it's not soft it's hard now what if i had a pencil what if I had a pencil? Let me find Mrs. Stewart's pencil right here. What if I touch this right here? What do you think that would be? Pokey. Pokey or sharp. Say sharp. 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 This would be sharp or like a knife would be sharp. We wouldn't want to play with a knife, would we? No, we would stay away. We let mommies and daddies use those and they cut up our food for us because that's sharp. Or a fork. That's why we have to be careful when we're using our fork at lunch that we don't put it anywhere near our faces because you know the, the prongs, those things that stick up like this, that part that you poke into the food, it's sharp so that it could get the food and you could pick up your steak or your chicken or your mashed potatoes and you eat it with that, but it's sharp. So those things are sharp. So we can feel all that. You can feel things that are hard. You can feel things that are soft and things like that. So today I have some things right here that you can, you can feel. Hmm. Now, but before we do that, let's review. If I was going to close your eyes, 
and I did this. <whistles> Open up your eyes. What sense did you use? You weren't using your sense of seeing, you were using your sense of what? Hearing. Hearing. What if you couldn't hear? What would that be called? Deaf. 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 Good. Now, what if we did this? You could. What is that? Knocking. Knocking. You could see me knocking, can't you? So you're using your what? Seeing. You're seeing, your sense of seeing. Good. So now we're going to talk about our sense of touch. So let's see. Hmm. Let's see. What bag do I want to start with first? Ah, this one right here. This one's fun. Let's see. Bethany, come. Come, reach in. You can't peek. Close your eyes. Reach in. How does that feel? Oh, you can't look at it yet. How does it feel? It feels soft? Is it soft like a stuffed animal? No. So what does it feel like? It feels hard, doesn't it? It feels hard. Pull it out. What is it? Show the boys and girls. It's a what? It's an apple. So is this soft like a stuffed animal? Yeah. No, it's hard. It is very hard. So I'm going to put that right. You can take it back to your seat, actually. There you go. You can put it on your name tag. So that's something that's hard. Hmm. Let's see. I wonder what's in here. Lauren. Don't look. Oh, turn in faces because I want the boys and girls to see your face. All right. You ready? Reach in there. Does it feel soft or hard? Or how does it feel to you? What do you think it is? Don't look. What do you think it is? Pull it out. What is it? It's toys. It's toys and they're hard. They're not soft toys. They're blocks, so they're hard. Good. All right. Hmm. Oh, this is really cool. You're, William, come. Mm, are you ready? Do you want to see what, feel what's in there? Close your eyes, turn around this way. I want the boys and girls to see your face. All right, ready? <gasps> what does that feel like? Is it soft, hard, squishy, or what? What is it? What does it feel like? Can you answer? Use your words. What does it feel? Tell me. Soft. It feels soft. Let's see, pull it out. Got it? You got the whole thing? That. Do you know what it is? It's a sea anemone. <laughs> Look at that. But does it feel soft? Does it feel it? It does, doesn't it? Or it's kind of squishy, isn't it? So it's not hard though. It's super soft when you want to feel that. It feels soft, doesn't it? You want to feel that too? Yeah. Oh, maybe later. Good. All right. You may take that back to your seat. Good. Let's see. Hmm. What else do I got? Oh, I think somebody might like this one. Myla, come. Reach in here and see. Turn and face this way. Don't pull it out yet. What does it feel like? Soft, hard, or squishy? Real loud. Soft, hard, or squishy? Answer. Oh my. Go sit down. I need children that's going to answer. Let's see. Lucia, come. Come answer. Soft, hard, or squishy? Come. What is it? Soft. It, is it soft? We'll pull it out. Let's see. Let's see if it really is soft. <gasps> what is that? It's a soft, a stuffed animal, so it's soft, isn't it? It's nice and soft. Look, let's feel. Is it soft on your face? It is. You can have it. You can go put that on your name tag. So we've had something that's hard, some other things that are soft or squishy. Oh, let me see. Hmm. There's something in here. This is something silly. Catherine, come. Hmm. This is something new, something different I haven't even talked about yet. Do you know what that might be? What does it feel like? Yeah. It feels soft? It could be soft. Pull it out. <laughs> what is that? You want to help Mrs. Stewart clean her house? <laughs> no. <laughs> Mrs. Stewart doesn't want to clean her house either. Look right here. That's not a fun job. Look right here. This is a rubber glove. So it feels rubbery like a rubber, like a rubber, um, rubber band. So it kind of feels kind of rubbery, doesn't it? It's kind of elasticy and rubbery like that. There you go. Now, I have something that I'm wearing. Hmm. Look what I'm wearing on my face. What are these called? Glasses. Glasses, yes, glasses. Now, would I touch with these glasses? No. What am I using? I'm using my sense of seeing. Seeing, because I'm using my glasses. If I took my glasses off, I can't see you. Nope, you're all blurry. But I use these to help me see and it helps me to be
be able to use my sense of seeing. And then I use my fingers, and my, my fingers help me to what? My sense of? Touching. My sense of touching, yes. And you know what? I can tell if I touch something and if it's warm. Like a cup of coffee. Oh, but Stuart loves to drink hot coffee. And I can tell if something's cold, like ice cubes. When you ever touch ice cubes or ice cream, it's cold. Or if something's hot, you can tell us, remember, maybe mommy says, don't touch that pan, it's hot. And if Mrs. Stewart forgets and I go to pull something out of the oven and I forget that I turn the oven on, sometimes I forget and I leave the pans in there. Sometimes mommies do that. And I forget and it's hot and I go, oh, like that, because I pulled my hands away because I can tell, because I'm using my sense of touch to be able to do that, just like you used your sense of touch. So today, maybe you could go home, don't touch things that are hot. But you could have fun with mommy and touch things and tell mommy, hey, you touch that. You could play this game with her. And you can use your sense of what? Feeling. To your sense of feeling or your sense of touch and play this fun game at your house too.